Sheriff found a local doctor who's encouraged by his results. Sharon Kaufman doesn't think of herself as a medical pioneer. The 47-year-old respiratory therapist from Pennsylvania is just trying to survive with stage 4 lung cancer, what some consider terminal. I'm smart enough to know that the prognosis is terrible for this disease. Lung cancer claimed the lives of anchorman Peter Jennings and Dana Reeve, the non-smoking widow of Superman actor Christopher Reeve. Last year, when Sharon lost her oldest son to bone cancer, she learned of a promising alternative treatment and began visiting Dr. Mark Rosenberg in Delray Beach to supplement her chemotherapy with intravenous vitamin C. Two weeks after we had initiated treatment, getting three infusions a week, the tumor marker went down to a little over a thousand. Uh, a week later it went down to 856 and then a week later it went down to 659. It's really good, especially when I see that the doctors are are so surprised. This therapy is based on findings published by the National Academy of Sciences showing that high concentrations of vitamin C stimulate production of hydrogen peroxide and that kills cancer cells in the laboratory. But there have been no studies on actual patients and local oncologists we checked with said it's way too late to comment on its effectiveness. I am excited but um, you know, it certainly has to be tempered by cautious enthusiasm. Sharon pays about $700 of her own money each week for the treatments because her insurance doesn't cover it, and she wonders why more research isn't being done. My feeling is that the government, somebody should be financing this because obviously the drug companies aren't interested in it because it's not profitable for them because they can't pack the vitamin and they can't make a lot of money off it. Dr. Rosenberg says Sharon has a good chance of beating the odds for a stage four cancer patient. It appears.